On the, on the first panel of the bus is the Glory Road Ministry symbol, which is on a cross shape, but it's the sort of shape you get on a, on a map when you're looking at a, at a road. And below that is the scripture that launched the ministry, which is Acts 8.29, where the God tells Philip to go alongside the chariot and speak to the people in the chariot. If we needed to give the gospel to truck drivers, we had to go to them on the road in their trucks, and that is what we do. The picture on the, the rear panel of the vehicle just shows a, a truck going along which represents drivers, um, the, the 500,000 drivers there are in the UK, uh, just going about their, their daily job. As we come round to the rear of the vehicle, it shows a, a motorway with two trucks on, and um, these have got question marks on the back, which we're showing really metaphorically that uh, drivers go along their, their journey every day, their journey in life, not really knowing which direction to go in. And on the back, the, you see a motorway symbol, and below it it says which way is your life going which is a, a question all of us have really got to answer and the motorway sign gives you the options of hard slog nowhere easy street or dead end and these are the options you've got really if you haven't got jesus in your life as you saw on the on the back of the bus the two lorries with a question mark on were going towards the the road which actually comes around the corner of the bus and uh, goes onto a road which is a suspension bridge through the clouds and the and this suspension bridge is supported by the glory road ministry sign and so we're trying to depict the drivers that that meet up with glory road we can lead them towards christ which is obviously represented by this superb picture of um, jesus on the cross and the the road goes straight towards jesus and it's a simple slogan on the side, not particularly scriptural, but it says, I did it for you. And this is designed when the bus is going along the road, especially motorways, that most drivers uh, looking at it from the opposite side of the road only have about two or three seconds to, to read what it says. So we get the, the message over very quickly with incredible impact with the artwork. And this was all supplied to us by a... Uh, an airbrush artist called Andy Scott who isn't a Christian and he supplied it at no charge at all which was a huge blessing to the ministry and this sort of artwork commercially on the trucks around us would be eight to ten thousand pounds to actually have it put on so it's uh, a tremendous blessing to the ministry.